Replacing these panels was long overdue. Steady down. Gently now. There. That's all 100 of them. This would be a lot easier if we had a certain extra pair of hands. Those extra hands haven't left the bridge in days. And is... Completely obsessed? I was going to say persistent. <laughs> Aunt, we missed you this morning. Uh-huh. Look, I know everyone has their own projects, but I do expect us to do some things as a family. Hmm. Aunt, are you listening to me? Yeah, yeah, I'll clean it later. <sighs> what are you working on? Huh? Oh, it's this symbol I found on the map. It's weird. Good weird. Really good weird, even. But weird. Plus, it's all on its own. But what is it? A table? A stool? Curved buildings? In a row, maybe? If you squint. That's it! You're a genius! I am? Don't you see? Buildings! In the middle of the ocean! It's a city! That's incredible! Better than that! After all this time, we finally found it! It's gotta be Lemuria. My family are explorers. We have been for generations. While others look up to the stars, we know there are an infinite number of things that shine in the darkness below. There are things lurking in the seas that long ago vanished into myth. My family are the Nectans, and we explore the deep. Whatever your symbol marks, Ant, we should see it any minute. I wonder what the Lemurians look like. Ant, there's no way there are actually people living down here. I'm thinking they'll have webbed feet and gills. And what, three eyes, orange skin? Don't be ridiculous, Fontaine. They'll be blue, for camouflage. Here we are. Huh? But this can't be it. Are you sure this is the spot? The coordinates match. If this is Lemuria, it's not what I pictured. Maybe whatever was here is long gone. Or maybe we just need to dig it up. Hmm. Huh. No ruins, no broken pottery. Not even a back in five minutes sign. Doesn't make any sense. It's gotta be something, right, Jeffrey? Jeffrey? <gasps> Everyone, look at this! Dolphins! Look where they're swimming! Are they carrying seaweed in their mouths? Last one in is a rotten egg! Ant! <sighs> well, if dolphins are heading in... I suppose it can't be too dangerous. Sure. Let's all head into the creepy mystery tunnel. As usual. Are you guys seeing this? I don't think this is Lemurian. Not old enough? Quite the opposite. It might be old enough. And where are you? Up ahead, middle corridor. What are these orbs? They look bioluminescent. Wait, so they're alive? Maybe. Fontaine, can you see... Fontaine? Just catching up to Ant. Where are you, Ant? You said the middle corridor. Don't tell me you're lost already, Fontaine. Yeah, right. This better not be a prank, Ant. Like, when you jump out of nowhere and try to scare me. Like I'd ever do that. Well, maybe I would. <laughs> I totally would. Where are you? Ant, I want us to stay together. Your mother and I are gonna catch up to you, and And... Keiko? Will, where are you? I was following you around that last corner, but then you just sort of disappeared. I'm right here, but... but... Huh? Uh, Ant, you didn't tell me there was a T intersection. What T intersection? Wait, guys, don't you see what's happening? You're leading us to our doom? No, this isn't just a tunnel. 
It's some kind of maze. Awesome! Well, it might be awesome if we weren't separated with limited oxygen. Okay, everyone stop right now. Then turn around and go back exactly the way you came. Oh, but Mom! We can see two dolphins. If we follow them, we might find out where they're... Aunt, don't make me ask twice. Uh, fine. Come on, Jeffrey. What the? Aunt. Uh, uh, coming. Anyone make it back to the entrance yet? Not me. Me neither. Nope. I think I might be lost, but... I mean, I'm back at the entrance. I wasn't lost. Right, Jeffrey? Right. Well, that's one down. Everyone keeps swimming and we should meet back. But I passed through here just a second ago. Oh, that's, that's impossible. That can't be good. Huh? Nectons, we have a problem. Dad? Will, what's going on? What's that grinding sound? I want everyone to stay exactly where they are. This isn't just a maze. It's a trap. So the maze is able to shift position. Shift positions? What, like some kind of ancient Rubik's Cube? But if the maze shifts, how do the dolphins know where they're going? Ant's right. Dolphins can only hold their breath for six or seven minutes tops. So it can't be blind luck that they're finding their way through. But even if we try to follow them, those dolphins swim way too fast for us. True. Unless... Come on, Jeffrey. Follow me. Ant, what are you doing? You'll see. Going solo again, Ant? You realize that's what got us into this mess? Yes, I do, Fontaine. And that's why I'm the one who's gonna get us out. <laughs> All right, Mimic Knight. Time to do what you were made for. Uh, is anyone else getting interference in their headset? I hear it too. <laughs> Guys, that's not interference. That's my dolphin voice. I'm following some right now in the Mimic Knight. My Mimic Knight? You put a single scratch on... Relax, Fontaine. I've used it before. When? When I was... Oh, wait. That was just a dream. <laughs> it was a good dream, though. What's your plan, anyway? I'm trying to blend in with the dolphins, Fontaine. They know the way through. Oh, hi, guys. <coughs> uh, uh-huh. Could someone tell Ant to stop being so weird? Okay, dolphins, show the new guy the way. I mean... Ant, if you put a scratch on my knight... <sighs> Relax, Fontaine. I'm in total control of... <sighs> what was that scraping noise? Uh, nothing. Hmm. So, um, anyone eating at any good seaweed places lately? Fontaine, Keiko, let's try to get back together as a group. I'm going to tap the walls at intervals like this. Tell me if you hear it. Did you guys hear that? Was it the maze moving? Maybe. And how are you doing with your dolphins? Whoa! <laughs> Speak to us, Ed. I'm using the Mimic Knight to map a route. I know the maze shifts, but if I can follow the dolphins through before the walls change position again, maybe I can... I touched the wall for balance, and it it's not really there. Some of these walls aren't real. What? They're some kind of projections, like some ancient magic trick. Are you saying the giant stone slab posing ahead of me isn't real? No, I'm not. Uh, uh. Whoa. Well, that one was real. Some walls move, some make noise, and some aren't really there at all. I guess it's hard to tell anything down here for sure. Unless you're a dolphin. They must see something we don't. If you want to see like a dolphin ant, just switch on the Mimic Knight's echolocator. Oh, of course. The echolocator. Duh. What's an echolocator? Clench your left hand twice. Huh? Wow. 
It mimics the way dolphins see, using sound waves, just like sonar. Cool. Center of the maze. What do you see? Actually, I can see one of you. Who? Not me. Not me either. Wait. No, it's definitely you, Dad. How far away am I? Uh, seriously, Dad? You're like right in front of me. What's with the weird hat? And maybe shut off sonar mode for a minute. <laughs> what is it then? What do you see? It's. It's a. Minotaur! Say again, Ant? Did you say Minotaur? Minotaur. M Minotaur. <sighs> Quit playing around. There's no such thing. Uh, why don't you come here and tell him yourself, Fontaine? Uh, good mythological creature. Nothing to see here. Wait. Do you think I'm a dolphin? I mean... Right, the dolphins feed you. Oh, uh, here you go. <laughs> well, it was nice meeting you. Nice place you got here. But uh, uh I've got to go. <laughs> Lost it. Fontaine, I know how this sounds, but. Ah! Ant, what's going on? Ant! Huh? It just wanted the seaweed. Ah! No, I'm sorry I invaded your home, shark, man, bull. <laughs> <laughs> huh? Nice to see you too, Ant. Ant, Fontaine, you found each other? Yes. Okay, don't leave each other's side. Your mom's right. We should have all stuck together in the first place. Since you two have the night, we'll stay put and wait for you. But what about the Minotaur? Seriously, Ant? He just swam down that passageway that... doesn't exist anymore. Ant, this maze is full of tricks. Maybe it fooled you into seeing something that wasn't there. You're pretty easily fooled. It's real! I'm telling you! There was a minotaur! Half bull, half shark, half man! It had three halves? I fed it some seaweed! <sighs> Let's just get out of here before your imagination gets us into anything. What was that? Huh, that loud, ominous, bellowing moo? Oh, probably just my imagination. There! Is that... Oh, no. Mom! Kids! Listen, that must be your father. He sounds like he's close. Ow! Yep, he's close. Uh, too close. Whoops. I'm sorry, Aunt. Looks like I finally found one of those fake walls. It must be these orbs. I think they mirror light and somehow project illusions. But some remain solid. Mom, did you hear the Minotaur? I heard something. If there is some kind of Minotaur down here, it can't be a coincidence that it's living in a maze. Yes, like the myth. But wasn't that maze on land? Yes, but myths get muddled over time. In some versions, the Minotaur was a gift from Poseidon, god of the sea. And does that version of the story come with a way out of here? Huh? Whoa! No, but he might know. Grab onto the Mimic Knight. Let's follow that dolphin. Uh-oh. What is... 
is this place? The Minotaur's dining room. And that's his dinner. Incredible. You weren't kidding at it. Do you have any idea of the significance of this discovery? Bulls are herbivores, which would explain its appetite for seaweed. Just because there's seaweed doesn't mean the Minotaur exists, Dad. Quick, rub onto me again! Oh! It's the Minotaur! What? It's a different color from before. <laughs> Everyone, get behind me! We are behind you! You must be half chameleon, too! I'm not after your food! Well, that explains what caused those craters. Which doorway do we take? The dolphin's long gone. We'll have to wait for another one. Wait? Here? That's crazy! <gasps> We have to find a way to keep it distracted. Tire it out. I'm open to all sorts of ideas. I've got it. And you handsome genius. <laughs> Don't worry, I've got this. Huh? <laughs> hey, you! Over here! <laughs> 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 Why won't it chase me? It loves seaweed. Because you look like a dolphin. Try setting the Mimic Knight to default mode, genius. Oh, right. Good idea, Fontaine. <laughs> hey, Minotaur! Feeling hungry? That's it. You know you want it. It's working, it. <laughs> Everyone get to safety and wait for a dolphin. I'll keep the Minotaur distracted. Uh, whoa! Come and get it, man shark bull! Oh, Minotaur, over here! I want seaweed, I want dinner. Dolphin, dolphin, please deliver! Ah! The maze is shifting again. Does that mean... Yes, right on time. Taking the scenic route. Don't worry, Fontaine. I squeak his language. Ugh. It's behind us! I think we might have offended it. Look out! Ah! There's our chance. I can't lose a dolphin! Ah! Where did the dolphin go? Be a fake. You don't know that ant. Ah, Never mind. It's real. <laughs> Nothing here. Maybe the dolphin was some kind of projection. Projection? Wait a sec. The dolphin sonar isn't tricked by light. That's how they see the right path every time. Then which way is out? Which wall is the projection? A wall! It's the ceiling! Look out! Stay back! I've got this! Ant, what are you doing? It won't hurt me as long as I'm in dolphin mode. Let me know when you're safely out. Then I'll leave. I'll be right behind you. Go! As soon as we're out, Ant. Not a second longer. Well... I'm a big fan of your legends. Ant, we're out. It's a holographic ceiling exit. Um, it's that noise again. Get out of there. See you later, Mr. Minotaur. Ow! What happened to the exit? It's solid. That noise must have been it changing. So it's a hologram and it moves? 
Limic Knight is glitching! Uh, uh. We're still friends, right? Ah! What's going on? Ant, are you all right? Huh? Oh no. Ant, come in! No way! The Minotaur didn't change colors. There's two of them! And they're both after me! Come in! Ant, are you okay? Oh no! Ant? Ant! Oh hey guys. I came out the main entrance. <laughs> you made it! Thank goodness you're okay. Way to go! I saw another Minotaur! That's six halves! Three times two, get it? So, who knows how many Minotaurs are living down there? or if the maze was designed to keep them in or us out. Either way, it works. Till today, we all thought the species was a myth. <sighs> I just can't believe I got the symbol for Lemuria so wrong. At least you found out the symbol isn't curved buildings. It's a bull's horns. So, if the Minotaur is real, that must mean Poseidon was real too. That's a pretty big leap. And centaurs must be real. Ant. And giants! Mom, make him stop. Maybe next time I say I discovered a mythical creature, Fontaine, you won't be so quick to doubt. I doubt that. Uh, I don't get it. Why does Jeffrey's video only have 20 views? I'm surprised it's even had 20. Wait, you watched it 20 times, didn't you? What? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. You really need to get out more. If a funny cat video can get a million hits, Jeffrey should be breaking the internet. Except... What? Funny cat videos are actually entertaining. Jeffrey is riveting. It's time he got the recognition he deserves. Jeffrey is one of the most impressive things in the ocean. He's three inches long. And... He's just as impressive as all the biggest marine animals. The biggest marine animals could swallow him without even noticing. Check this out, guys. They called me obsessive. Called me delusional. Is that Devil Daniels? But after months at sea, hunting down this, this beast, I'm pleased to say I finally found it. The big one really is out there. Hmm. No prizes for guessing what he's gonna do to whatever poor creature he's hunting. Not if we can help it. I'll log his coordinates onto the GPS. Such a creature should of course be approached with caution. But I'm pleased to say I'm equipped for any scenario. That looks dangerous. No, she blows! Did you see what I just saw? Have you ever seen anything like it? Devil Daniels, the world's greatest monster hunter, brings you the world's largest whale! A white whale that big? Impossible! My family are explorers. We have been for generations. While others look up to the stars, we know there are an infinite number of things that shine in the darkness below. There are things lurking in the seas that long ago vanished into myth. My family are the Nectins, and we explore the deep. Super white whale. It makes those others look like babies. That's the biggest sperm whale I've ever seen. It's incredible. Don't worry, Jeffrey. You may not be a whale, but you're mighty. Mighty small. Ignore her. You're at least as amazing as a white whale. He knows you're lying. Wait a minute. Peculiar snow white wrinkled forehead. A high pyramidical white hump. A pattern of strange white marbling on its body. A 
deform lower jaw and three puncture wounds on the right fluke. <gasps> It's exactly how Herman Melville described it 150 years ago! The Moby Dick? I suppose it is possible. Wells can live for hundreds of years. You have got to be kidding me. Moby Dick? Stay out of sight of Daniel's camera drones. The best way to protect it is to steer the whale away from Daniel's. And guys, be careful. Moby Dick was supposed to be a wild, uncontrolled force of nature. Relax, Mom. We've handled a whale before. I don't think we've handled a whale like that before. Whoa. He's magnificent. This guy's not so scary. He's got battle scars, but he seems like a gentle giant. Take a look, Fontaine. Pass. I like my supersized whales at a distance. Hey, big guy. I'm Ant. That's my sister, Fontaine. It's nice to meet you. Wow. Forehead, hump, jaw, the scars. It's... it's Moby Dick. I was just using this book as a how-to. I didn't expect to find the Moby Dick. Oh, the stars have aligned. Like Captain Ahab, I'm destined for glory, folks. The most dangerous marine creature in history. And I, Devil Daniels, am going to capture him. Captain Ahab was so lucky he lived to tell the tale. Fontaine necked in here, Mr. Daniels. Uh, what? <laughs> Fontaine! Lovely to hear from a long-term fan. Yeah, whatever. Have you actually read the ending of the book? Wait. Ahab doesn't make it to the end? I mean, of course he doesn't! We're dealing with a dangerous monster here! But I shall succeed where Ahab failed. This whale is ancient, Daniels! Thank you for radioing in, but I'm broadcasting live. Leave him alone! If you hurt him... Hurt him? I didn't want to hurt him. You don't? Of course not! Not when he's the perfect first exhibit for... Devil Daniel's Adventure World! The soon-to-be home of Moby Dick! Daniels, this is William Necton. Ah, another long-term fan. How can I help, Will? You can help by stopping this hunt. The whale needs to be left alone, not kept in captivity. Loyal fans, friends. There will always be people opposing the greater good. Farewell, my valiant foes! Why are the whales all staying on the surface? He's separating Moby from his pod. They're being fed. Daniels is playing dirty. <sighs> We're gonna have to step in. Abandon your mission, Daniels. There's no way you can guide a whale that size all the way back to land. <laughs> I'm not planning on guiding it. I'm planning on towing it. Sperm whales are protected in this area. If you harm one, there will be consequences. Why would I hurt my star attraction? Oh no! What's he doing? Fontaine, look out! Cups. 
Whoa! Now he was never going to go quietly. Fearsome monster that he is! Yes! Nice work, guys. That could have been ugly. Actually, it is a little ugly. The Aranex isn't going anywhere. doing listen he's grateful <laughs> he thinks he's found a new friend he must think the aranax is a whale i think he's trying to give us a hug that's sweet but we're already damaged and we can only take so much whale affection <laughs> those foolish foolish fools they've gotten too close to the legendary fearsome monster and now moby dick is attacking their submarine and the messages of support are already pouring in. Please save those helpless Neptunes. I'll do my very best. Okay. Low-frequency sound waves used by nuclear submarines often cause wills to go off course. We could try using it to move them away. Worth a shot. It won't hurt him? Don't worry, Ant. At low levels, it'll just make him a bit docile. Like how Ant gets around cookies? Exactly. Here goes. What are they doing? Keep it going! It's working! Aha! Using sound waves to guide the whale. Brilliant! How's our chance to fix that tailplane? Okay, guys, get ready to take the weight. <laughs> Daniels is on the move! Huh? Oh no! We showed him how to use the sound waves! Loyal viewers, I've, unsurprisingly, come up with another brilliant idea! You too can demonstrate brilliance by subscribing to my video channel now! Let's go after them! <laughs> We're a little indisposed at the moment, Dad! I'll take the weight! No way. It's too heavy. She's right, Will. You can't hold it on your own. I'll fix this as quickly as I can. Devil Daniel's Adventure World opens tomorrow morning. It'll be the biggest show ever with the biggest star ever. <laughs> no, not me. Moby Dick. Subscribe to my video channel now or miss out. Okay. The Magnite should be able to hold it up on its own. Right. Let's go, Fontaine. We'll follow as soon as we can. We need to move fast. Yes, there he is. I'll disable the sound blaster on Daniel's boat. Talk to Moby. Calm him down. He'll recognize him. Gotcha. Huh? <laughs> Too late, Nectons. What? Whoa! This can't be happening. For you. Sticks and stones, kid. The whale was fair game. And this monster will reel in the crowds and the subscribers and their glorious hunger for cheap merchandise. You know, I think I'll expand. Like your ego? Exactly. I've got it all worked out. It'll be spectacular. You can't keep him in captivity. Can and will. You don't care about him at all! 
What I care about is the millions of hits since I caught him. People are eating this up. I'll be a zillionaire. At the expense of a whale's well-being. Oh, boo-hoo. Run along before I get all teary. You can't do anything. Hey! Let Moby go! No way. I can't disappoint my fans. And that whale is just the start. Soon I'll have more fantastical creatures. Megalodon, giant squid, Nessie! And in case you're getting any funny ideas, this baby activates my state-of-the-art security system. Observe. Those doors are reinforced steel, locked and hooked up to an alarm system. You'll never get past those motion sensors. Things don't look good, Ant. I want to see him. Check that he's okay. Sure, no problem. Live security camera feed. See, he's alive and well. The tank is tiny. A little cramped, but he'll get used to it. How do you live with yourself? You know I'm remarkably good company? Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm going live to the world in the morning. And even this much beauty needs his beauty sleep. Herman Melville must be turning in his grave. Uh, who? He wrote the book! Let it go, Ant. Dad, we have to protect him! Not like this. You heard your father. Run along. Soon Moby will be Daniel's main attraction. We just can't sit back and let him get away with this. Of course we can't. And we won't. What are you saying? It's time for a whale break. Let's do this. Good luck, guys. We need perfect timing here. You both know what to do? Deactivated. Yeah. Oh. Huh? What the? That's weird. We've got vision. Video set to loop. Oh no! Oh, if people could see you in action like this, Jeffrey, you'd easily be as famous as Moby Dick. Activate the locks. At last, the moment has arrived. Ready for your close-up, Moby? Okay, Ed. Now. Yes. Hey, Moby. Remember me? Viewers. In exactly five minutes, I'll be unveiling the greatest living creature ever known. <laughs> Look at the hits we're getting. Thousands more every second. I hope we don't break the internet. <laughs> Oops. Luckily, I keep a spare.
The doors are closing! No! Bad idea. Huh? Need a little help? Mom. <laughs> Good idea. <laughs> In just 30 seconds, I'll be bringing you the great white whale! Today, we begin a whole new era of entertaining animals in captivity. Some call it cruel, but you and I know it as showbiz! And now, Devil Daniel's Adventure Park, in conjunction with Devil Daniel's Merchandising and the Monster Hunter Corporation, Proudly presents the greatest show on earth, the great white whale himself, Moby Dick! What? What? What have you done with my whale? Yeah. You've been watching a recording, Daniels. Huh? Ha! <laughs> I told you! It was only a matter of time. Jeffrey is famous. <laughs> <laughs> yes, 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 yes! Go, Jeffrey! Right now, Jeffrey is the biggest thing in the ocean. This is sabotage, loyal fans. I have enemies who are jealous. But Devil Daniels will rebuild. He'll come back bigger and... my giant whales at a distance. The signal's getting stronger. Moby's pod is close below.